The Office of the Ombudsman says three weeks after news about the alleged illegal sale of NFA rice to traders broke out, they have yet to receive all the documents they need from the National Food Authority to continue the conduct their probe on the incident. To recall, Ombudsman Samuel Martirez personally went to the NFA office on March 7 to serve a subpoena to get the documents needed to conduct an investigation on the said matter. So far, the Ombudsman stated it has only received a partial list of NFA warehouses. That's why it warned the NFA personnel in charge of dispensing such documents could be cited for contempt or charged with obstruction of justice for failing to provide what the subpoena had earlier required. Pero kung kami matatagal lang din dito sa pag-iimbestiga sa kasong ito, eh, baka humantong kami sa hindi magandang pag-uusap. At gamitin namin ang aming contempt powers because the Office of the Obons well as contempt powers, we can charge them for obstruction of justice.